Did you know that Timu has custom-made neon signs? They do. Stay tuned. Good morning, everyone. Let's have coffee together. So we will discuss this custom-made neon sign a little later in my video. But welcome to my channel. If you are new here, welcome to my channel. Uh, we have a lot of fun here. We do Timu hauls, and there will be upcoming Dollar Tree reviews. Also, if you are returning to my channel, thank you for being here. My videos are not sponsored by Timu or anyone else. All these items are paid for by me or my daughter-in-law. Sometimes she gives me a couple of items to show on my channel. Also on my channel, I do remove the items from the bag to show them because I record with my phone. So I will never be scrolling through my phone while you guys are watching. Uh, if you like my content, please hit the like and subscribe button. That really helps these channels, you guys. Just, you know, even if you just watch the channel in the background while you're doing dishes or whatever, that, that helps a lot. And my videos are usually shorter in length. I, I don't have any videos that go like to an hour, hour and a half. I'm not saying it won't happen in the future, but right now that's how we're doing it. And I do have another neon sign to show you guys. This is a gaming neon sign. It is not dimmable. It just, it just turns on and off. But isn't that cute? It was 1078. It's called a one piece game. Game pad LED neon sign for wall and table decor, decor, USB powered. Now, what little boy wouldn't like this in his room on his wall? So I don't think it matters if they're five years old or 20 years old. They would probably enjoy having this in their room on their wall. I think this is just, and they do come in different designs. And I don't know if the different designs are are like the different controllers for different games. I'm not sure. But um but yeah, I got this for my actually I got one for my 20, I think he's 20 now or 19 year old grandson, and the other one for my five year old grandson. <laughs> and they will both enjoy it very much. So that was that one. And then I got this, where is it? This is called a silicone dish drying mat, but it's not. It's called a one piece kitchen sink splash guard is what it really is. Faucet draining pad, and this is what it looks like. And it's got the little opening here that you would slide down over your faucet. And then the back of it, which I kind of liked, the back of it folds folds up so it would go on your sink like this so if any water splashes back it would get caught on this so yeah I thought this was you know I usually try to buy things I need or like <laughs> sometimes it's just a likable purchase oh and I oh my gosh Okay, so my daughter-in-law is not as dark as some of the rest of the family. You know, we have like Native American, some Native American and some Spanish in our family. And she burns. She burns with the sun. So I saw these. These are UV protection cooling arm sleeve with thumb hole, sun protection sleeve. It protects from UV rays. So you just put them on your arm, you know, and it's supposed to protect you from getting burned. And they came in different colors, and I got four pair for $2.98. And I got the blue ones. They do say, say something on them. I noticed just about all of them do have wording on them. I got the black ones. They're stretchable. They're supposed to be one size fits all. I got the white ones. They're just supposed to be real thin and cool on your arms. Now these say something else. These say Aqua X. And the other ones said Let's Slim or something. I don't I don't know. 
And then here's the gray ones. So yeah, I, and then I bought a bunch. You know, I got pink ones in here, blue ones, gray ones, white ones. I got two more pairs of blue ones. The blue are really pretty. And then I noticed they have children's, children's too. So I, I'll i probably get some for my grandson. And then I saw that they had these, which are the, these are actually like the shawl type, like this would go behind your back. Which I thought these were better, because what if you were wearing these and they started sliding down your arm? You know, I thought these would be kind of better because you actually put these back behind your shoulders. <laughs> you put your put your arms in like that. And see, you have this piece in back. I will figure. One size fits all, right? So you put it on like that. And then this. But you get the idea. Then you know what I mean? It keeps them on your arms. I don't know if I have it on right. <laughs> it feels like it should be lower on my back, which I can't reach. But yeah, then they wouldn't slip down off your... These seem to be long for me. Let's see if I put my... Oh, maybe if you put your thumb in there. And they fit better so that's that's called the shawl type and they're UV protection from the Sun and then this color I got a pink one <clears throat> where's the white one and I got the white one which I would think white would be better for being you know in the Sun but aren't these nice and if you look these up on Amazon, they sell for much more than what um, Timo sells them for. But yeah, I think the shawl type are going to be my favorite. And I hope <clears throat> I don't need them. I don't burn. I tan <laughs> like a lot of my family. But um, I think the shawl type, for if I can find them in the kids' sizes, I will get him the shawl type also. And then we got the... I think I showed this before, but I bought one for me. <clears throat> the other one was for my daughter-in-law. But these are really quality made, you guys. I guess they're called uh, <clears throat> crossbody bags. And I think I'm going to get myself the gray one. And these are nice because they have three zippers. Three zipper uh, sections in front. They have the little one there. They have another one here. Then they have the top one here. There's actually quite a bit of room in there. And then on the back, they have this other zipper on the back, which is, you know, pretty good room in there too. So yeah, these are, <clears throat> these came in, well, the ones I bought came in two colors, this black color and the gray color. And it's got the really nice strap, sturdy strap. And that was $317. <clears throat> the shawls, the shawls I showed were uh, $188. And I thought, what a good idea, you know, for the people that maybe don't want, like to put like the sunscreen on their body and stuff. <clears throat> okay, let's move right along so we don't go too long here. <clears throat> and then I saw these, <clears throat> I have a frog in my throat, you guys, I'm sorry. <clears throat> and then I found these multi-purpose disposable cleaning wipes, efficient lens and jewelry cleaners. And I thought, why not? You know, let's, let's try them. So you open it up. Oh, it's tiny. But how big do you need it really to clean your glasses? I wouldn't think that big, but there it is. It does 
half a chemically smell, of course. There's probably some kind of cleaning. But that's the little wipes. And this is what they look like. And I guess you can use them for jewelry cleaning, lens cleaning, clean your glasses. Yeah, I thought those would be convenient. You know, put them in your purse. A lot of times when you're not home and you don't have your regular glass glasses cleaning stuff. Now this was a purchase from my daughter-in-law. She bought a LED projector. She said, we're going to have movie nights, like outside or on the ceiling or well, I don't know. <laughs> this was $22.40. It's a portable mini projector for home theater and outdoor movies. <clears throat> HD video projector with USB interfaces and remote control. Now, you guys, I did look this up on Timo. These are selling for all different prices. So look around at the different vendors. You could probably get this, you know, at different prices. Like, you could probably find it cheaper. And I will just show, give you a quick show you what it looks like. Can I drop something? And it's just a little mini projector. And it comes with the cord and the directions. And this is what it looks like. It's kind of cute actually. It's got the feet on the bottom. It's got some connections here. Connections here. Yeah. So she bought that for the, you know, for the baby. They enjoy they enjoy watching movies <clears throat> at home and so do I. I actually get a lot of my movies from the library. <clears throat> you know, did you know you could rent movies from the library? Well, not rent them, they're free. <clears throat> but now that I got my new phone, what's wrong with my throat, you guys? <clears throat> let's get a, let's hydrate. <clears throat> did that help? <laughs> that helped. Okay, where's my next item? Uh oh, it's not over here. There, there it is. <clears throat> so I have with my new phone. I got, I got Netflix because I got home internet too. It, it was a bundle. So I have Netflix now on my TV, and I have Apple Plus TV, which I don't, I don't even know. Which I have to have my son hook up for me. Look at this, you guys. Is this adorable or what? It's a little mini keychain light, and it looks like one of those flashlights. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, it don't stay on. You have to press it to, to keep it on. But I thought for like at night, you know, when you need to put your key in the car or uh, the key in your house door. I thought that was adorable. And that's just called a mini flashlight keychain, small LED, and it came in many colors. Am I almost done already? Huh. I guess this is going to be a small haul. Okay, next I want to show you <clears throat> this ring that I got, which I think I've hauled this before. But like I said, I'm kind of having, you know, I don't wear the same size as I used to. <clears throat> Arthritis will do that to you. It's a two-piece set. I'll try to show you guys the two different pieces. See the two different pieces? Aren't they pretty? I think they are. It's like a, you know, turquoise and rhinestone. And that's called a... Boho style stacking rings inlaid turquoise and rhinestone. And I have a couple of necklaces that I've showed in past videos that will match this. And then I got this bracelet. Where is it? This is called a silvery cross border inlaid green agate bracelet. And it came in green, silvery, black or pink. And I got the silvery color. Can you see the color? Color of it? 
and it is adjustable. It does pull apart. So you can, well, I'm going to have to pull it apart to get it on my wrist. But isn't that pretty? I thought that was so pretty. Okay. And then, of course, I'm buying more headbands. And these were, the bracelet was one ninety-five, and the ring was one thirty-four. And these headbands were 97 cents, and this is the latest ones I got. And these are just the twist tie in the back. I just love, the material is so soft and comfortable. I just love these headbands from Timu. And I got that one this time. And I got this one. Sorry for the crinkling. I got this one this time. A little bit different color than my other one, which was more of a gray black. This one has a little bit of color in it. it has blue, green, a little bit of yellow in there, a little bit of pink. Isn't that pretty? And then, which I don't think I wrote this down, but I got another one of these. You know, the other two I I got, they went to my um they went to my owl purses. Well I've ordered a couple of more in different colors. This is the this is like a dark what color would you call this? Some of the colors at Team were a little this is like a dark navy blue one. Almost they call it a na like a dark blue. Heard the I just think these little owl coin purse, keychain, purse charm things are just so adorable. I just love them. Now for the custom neon sign. Of course, I got this for my grandson. And these do come in different colors and different prices. The price depends on, on how big of a sign you want and how many letters are on the sign. And it's called a customized neon sign, LED personalized USB powered neon light. It came in 11 different colors. You get to choose your color, choose what it says, and choose what size you want. And what I like about this one, where's the on button? There it is. It says Andrew for my grand, this is for my older grandson. And what I like about this one is, look, you guys, it's adjustable. Ooh, that's really bright. You can make it brighter. Or dimmer, which is kind of nice. I kind of like that. And it just has the little, you know, uh, you can hang it with like a nail or a hook in your wall. So yeah, I think he's going to really like that. Cheese. Cheese. I'm really liking these neon signs from Timu. You, you know, you could get so many different ones. You could get custom ones. They're they're fairly inexpensive. I said this one was $22.98. Now it's $27.48. And have you guys noticed that prices on Timo are just skyrocketing? In fact, I was at Dollar General yesterday and I noticed a lot of the same things that they sell on Timo are also sold at Dollar Tree for a much cheaper price, which I will do an upcoming uh, Dollar Tree review. I just kind of want to do a comparison between Timo products and, and uh, Dollar Tree products and show you the difference in price between the two. Timu's getting quite pricey with some of their items, but if you do shop around, you could get the same item, these, these things, you can get the same item for cheaper prices because not all vendors have the same price. They'll be selling the same product, but not at the same price. So I do have a small Walmart haul. Remember I was telling you guys that you can get things at Walmart for $1? Occasionally, well, look. 
Knits a Justice backpack. These are all Justice backpacks. They had a whole cart full of them. And this is the front. And it's got the sequin front. Do you see that? And then this is actually a two-piece. It comes with a backpack and the lunch bag, which I thought was really nice. And then this is the back. But these are quality backpacks, you guys, for one dollar. These will be donated. These will be donated to the, <clears throat> the homeless shelter. I really like to give back. You know, I was homeless at one point. It was more, it was more, um, how do you say it? I went to Florida with an ex, with one of my exes, thinking we could rekindle the romance <laughs> and ended up homeless. This one also, look, it was a dollar. It's Justice. It's got the little hanging charm or keychain. You could use it as a keychain. And it's got the applique patches. Isn't that cute? I really like this one. My daughter-in-law th thought she might want to keep this one, but she, she decided not to. She said she's getting too much stuff. <laughs> this is the back of it. This one is just adorable. If I still had small uh, little girl grandchildren, that would probably go to them. This is the next one. Justice. And this one's black with white writing and like blue trim. It's really pretty. I think all of these are really pretty. Oh, it says Justice Sport right here. It's got plastic over it. <clears throat> this is the back of this one. There's the straps. And then the last one is like this. It's like a shiny shiny silvery all over all over bag this is the back of it so yeah one time it was I walked into Walmart and it was backpacks another time I walked into Walmart and it was shoes you never know you never know what they're gonna have in the cart for one dollar and it's <clears throat> There's that frog again. And it's not all the time. It's only occasionally. So I guess it's just the luck of the draw. You walk in and and uh, they, either they'll have it or they won't. So that was my haul for today. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. Until next time. Bye.